Harvey Wan and Mark Resenthal with you on this Saturday. Boy, did you look out the window? It's pouring out. The winds are howling from the northeast. Take it slow and easy today. The good news is by the time we do karaoke tonight with Joanne and Jethro Mills at Ray's New Garden Restaurant, the rain, the worst of the rain is done. Just a few showers around. All right, let's get into it. First of all, with the forecast today being brought to you by our good friends at Quirk Chrysler Jeep, located at 441 Quincy Avenue, Braintree. Winter's coming. Don't let old man winter push you around. Get a great deal now on a 2018 Jeep. Call 781-917-1444 online at CorkChryslerJeep.com. Weather headline time would suggest a very stormy Saturday. There could be some flooding along the shore at the time of high tide. Could be some flooding of stream streets and basements as well. But a milder Sunday, a wet Monday, and then much milder weather coming in next week with temps in the 50s near 60. We get a break. For today, no such luck. It's rain, heavy at times, windy, east winds 25 to 55 miles an hour. We do have a high wind warning in effect, temperatures in the 40s and low 50s. But the worst of the storm for Boston should be over by mid-afternoon. Then overnight, want to go out, you can do it. Cloudy skies, just a few showers around 45 to 50. Now here's your five-day forecast starting with tomorrow. A lot of clouds, maybe a little peekaboo sun, milder in the 50s. Then an upper level disturbance comes through on Monday with occasional showers around and cooler. It'll be 47, but look at Tuesday, much milder, sunny, 55 to 60. There'll be a front coming through on Wednesday with a lot of clouds around and temperatures in the 50s, maybe a few showers, but should be very mild for Halloween. Right now on Thursday, it looks like a warm front's going to lift north of us, and if that's the case, it's sun and clouds and mild with temperatures in the lower 60s. So there you go. That's my forecast. Thanks for checking in. Please stay tuned for updates. I'm Mark Eisenthal.